So a lot of people here don't have the opportunity to practice their English with people that are around them. Elsa AI basically will help you practice free speech, so everyday conversations. Um, and these conversations are going to mimic real life. They're going to be as close as possible to a real interaction with another person. But what's amazing with that is that we've combined it to create uh, also an Elsa feature, which gives you feedback on your speech after you've had that conversation. Generative AI plus Elsa speak equals Elsa AI. As you know, recently uh, in the world of technology at large, we've had OpenAI, ChatGPT that have arrived on the scene in the field of technology. So basically Elsa AI is a marriage between generative AI and the assessment power of Elsa speak. There are preloaded scenarios in Elsa AI. What does that mean? Well, at Elsa, we have a team of writers and teachers that know what sort of situations and scenarios are going to be the most common and the most useful for you to practice. All right. So we're going to have scenarios about everyday conversation, uh, about, uh, for example, uh, conversations at work, maybe interview questions so that you can practice job interviews. We have created a whole bunch of preloaded scenarios that you can practice around different topics. So everyday situations, uh, relationships, uh, conversations at work, job interviews, and so on. So we've created a set of preloaded scenarios for you to practice. So I'm going to remove my um, my video background for a second here. So you're going to see the, <laughs> the back of my house. But I want to show you guys what that looks like. Now, Elsa AI will pick up exactly what I said. Look at this. And now Elsa is coming up, hopefully with a definition, uh, with a uh, about to give a blood transfusion to a patient. I will be playing the role of the patient. We are in a hospital room and your goal is to give helpful tips to the patient to help them relax before the blood transfusion. My goal as the patient is to feel calm and comfortable during the procedure. Are you ready to begin or is there anything you'd like to change in the scenario? So now Elsa has understood the scenario I want to play clearly, all right? It's also asking me if I want to start, if I want to create a new scenario, or if I want to swap roles. So maybe I want to be the patient and you want to be, uh, and, and I want Elsa AI to be the nurse. Now we're in character. You see here, the role play has started and someone tells me, hello there, how are you feeling today? I'm going to tell them that I'm a little bit stressed about my blood transfusion. Hi there, I'm a little bit nervous about my blood transfusion. How could I relax? Some deep breaths slowly and exhale. This will help you to calm down. You could also try some guided imagery through visualizing your happy moments. Try having guided imagery. Focus on happy memories. And try to distract yourself by watching TV or an iPad, for example. Before we start, need to check your vitals and confirm your identity. Could you please confirm your full name and date of birth? My name is Simon Kfeller. I was born on the 17th of August, 1987. Not my real date of birth, by the way. Thank you. Your identity. Everything looks good to go. Let's start the procedure. And Just so relax. on. The conversation Here, continues you. like that. We're having a real time conversation on a subject that I chose. I don't know about you, but I think that's pretty amazing. Practice and prepare for interviews, meetings, casual conversations anywhere and at any time. I can't be anywhere and speak in the phone. What if I'm on the bus? Well, we have a silent version of Elsa AI, so you can type instead of speaking. No excuses. You can practice anywhere and at any time. Conversation practice is the key to building fluency in English.
it's kind of a secret and not a secret, but why I wanted to have this as my number five secret here. All right. So transitioning from passive language to active language comes through conversation. All right. Having everyday practice and interactions using English is really what will help you develop your skills as a language learner. All right.